Hey, hey, welcome back to Bozzy Callahan's Word of Advice. And in this video today, I'm going to talk about the topic of rejection. Oh, such a fine topic indeed. And before I really get into this topic, let me just say, this is about rejection from either a crush or a job that you want, a part you want to play, or anything else you can think of. It's not just limited to getting rejected from somebody that you like. This is about just getting rejected from something in general. I think it's safe to say that when it comes to rejection, most of us feel a little sad for a bit because we didn't get something that we wanted. Maybe we feel like we are inferior to other people. Maybe we feel that we are not good enough. And if there's really any important piece of advice I could say about this topic, it would be this. If you get rejected from something, don't let that change who you are. I know some people, if they get rejected from anything, they may start to change themselves so they can be somebody that is more appealing to the outside world. And people start to lose their true personality. People try to become a fake because they want to be accepted. And honestly, this breaks my heart when I see people changing from something real to unreal just because somebody or something did not want them. In the end, I mean, even if some people change who they are and they start getting more of what they want, they're still kind of living a lie. And living a lie is not very fun or very easy. In the end, I would always say, be who you are to people out in the world. Always give an honest representation of who you are because only you can be you. And it hurts when I say this, but it's true that not everybody or everything is going to want you. We can't always get everything that we want. But if we do act ourselves and express to people who we truly are, then odds are we will find people and find opportunities that will be accepting of who we really are. Me, for a little bit, I tried to be somebody else because I dealt with rejection for many years and honestly it didn't get me anywhere. But then when I realized that I should start acting myself, and I started acting like myself. I gained acceptance from people who appreciated my character and I gained acceptance from opportunities that could understand what I'm really like. And I am very happy acting myself today. Even though I know that not every opportunity or every person is going to accept me, I realize that if I act myself then I will find people and opportunities that will accept me. And I have no doubt that if you act yourself as well, that you will find opportunities and people who will accept you for who you are. So in closing, just remember, if you get rejected from something or somebody, don't change who you are just so you can be accepted. Always try to maintain your true character because I have no doubt that the right people and the right opportunities will accept you for who you truly are and when you act like who you truly are. And with that, I certainly hope the advice I talked about in this video will come in handy. Always remember to stay true to your character. Don't let rejection change who you are and come back for another word of advice video.